I've decided today that I'm gonna vlog. Welcome to the vlog. I'm going to take you guys on what I'm up to today. Um, I have an eye appointment later, and so I'm gonna bring you guys to the eye appointment. I'm also gonna go through my closet and see what in this closet I don't want. Get ready with me. So this is my closet, all of my clothes, and let's pick something to wear. It's like 40 degrees outside. I think I'm gonna wear this top um, with this layered on top of it. So these are like my sleeves. I might go for black jeans or I have these really cool pants I got from Cider Shop. This, this was so cute. I had to get it. It was also on sale. The other option are just these like black jeans. Um, I don't know where these are from, but let's try it on. The blue jeans are not a move, so we're gonna go with the black. So, this is the outfit today, just these black jeans, um, this really cute shirt, undershirt, and then this vest on top. So for jewelry, I'm wearing this little gold necklace here um, that my mom got me. And then I'm wearing this really cute, this ring is like my family ring. And then this little T right here, it like, it's a jewel or like um, a little charm ring. And then this Gucci ring. And then I'm wearing these little dainty ones um, from... This little shop called Ursa, it's like this green emerald little one, and then a snake one. I don't know if you can see it. For shoes, I decided to go for these boots. These are my favorite boots. They're the Pull and Bear boots um, by Pull and Bear. <laughs> And I'm like, are you kidding me? 10 to 14 days. I'm supposed to leave for vacation soon. What am I gonna do? I guess I can keep wearing these. They're broken though right here. My other one's split in half, so I can't wear those unless I tape them. But uh, I might just have to sacrifice and wear these on my vacation. Um, it would be nice to have the new ones, but... Um, Hopefully those come in literally the day before I leave because that's in like two weeks. I am home now and I'm super hungry. I didn't eat, so I'm gonna find something to eat. I'm gonna go for two eggs and um, some bread. Just like a sandwich vibe. I actually have hash browns, so I'm gonna be making hash browns with my eggs instead of bread. The eye doctors was very interesting. They were doing like a telehealth thing. You literally meet the doctor via like Zoom. There's like a technician that like helps like move the little like things around. They said my eye prescription didn't really fluctuate, which is good. For one, I know my they're doing their job correct. And for two, um, my vision's just not changing anymore, which is good because I hate being blind and I don't want to be any more blind than I already am and I have an astigmatism and um, the guy or the doctor was saying that it probably fluctuates like a fourth a, like a fourth of a something I don't know measurement um, every year and so super normal mine fluctuated by a fourth which is like normal yeah 
I have the air fryer going. I'm gonna put the hash browns in the air fryer and then I'm gonna cook up these eggs. I'm actually gonna do three eggs um, because Big Girl got Big Eats. Now that I'm done eating, I had um, hash browns, eggs, and a banana, and I'm gonna clean my closet. We're in my closet. I am just gonna go through all the stuff at the top, and then I'm gonna put it into two separate piles. Like, I might wanna sell it or just give it away. of my clothes as you saw i didn't take that much but a lot of it is like pants too and so we're gonna go through all the pants i have some already over here that i need to get rid of but we're gonna go through the pants i just finished going through my closet i won't show you guys the clothes just because it's boring but i went through a couple i probably grabbed around like 10 shirts and like almost 10 pants. I'm gonna wait till my partner gets here and then we're gonna go through all of them. We might add some more or we might, you know, actually never mind some and take it back. We finally went through all of our clothes. We have this stuff here. This is what we're gonna try to sell right here. These three bags on the floor. That's all, that's all going to Goodwill. This is what the closet looks like right now. We have a little bit more space, like a lot more space. We went through some of our pants, um, but we still have so many pants. It's a mess. We're at Mad Chicken. If y'all have never had Mad Chicken before, you should probably try it because it's really fucking good. I love the Mad Fries. Are you excited for your Mad Fries? <laughs> I got- I'm so hungry. I got the mad fries, of course, with the um, mad mad fire sauce on the side and ranch. Yeah, and it took him five minutes just to figure out what sauce it was choosing. Well, damn, who hurt you today? Okay, bye. This is what the mad chicken looks like inside. Yeah. Oh my god! Wow! Okay, it doesn't look that appetizing, but like, trust me, this is like a good combo. Mad fire sauce, ranch, Sprite, and Pink Panther. Good morning, it's the next day. We are going to try to look for fabric to reupholster my sofa. I've been really wanting to reupholster the sofa I have. It's, I literally got it for free on Facebook Market. 
And right now there's just like a white slip cover over it. I'm kind of over the white slip cover and I'm ready to take on the reupholstering project. I did buy a um, hand stapler, which I know probably isn't the best idea, but also this is my first project doing reupholstery. So um, let's see. We're gonna go to West Elm to try to find some curtains because they always have curtains on sale. I really love their like worn velvet curtains. I might go for a linen. I don't know. I want like a neutral color. I was looking at this like alabaster off-white linen curtain. It's really cute. So this is the outfit of the day. Um, I am wearing just some black like corduroy pants. I don't know if you can see the corduroy. Ew, they're so linty. So much lint and cat hair. And this unfinished legacy shirt. Um, that's it. I'm gonna put some jewelry on and then probably go to West Elm. I forgot that I also have those three bags of Goodwill stuff that I need to take um, to Goodwill. And so we're probably gonna make a stop at Goodwill. Okay, actually, no. I can't take all those three bags by myself. I'm actually at Whole Foods and I'm looking for matcha because I'm really craving matcha and so I'm trying to find the tea aisle. I found the milk. Don't really need milk. Back from Whole Foods and damn. Well, I can't wait to show you guys what I got, and um, I can't wait to make my matcha. I'm back from Whole Foods, and I picked up my package. So first of all, I did get one of these because I've seen a lot of people use them for their matcha, and I just realized I had the little Keurig milk frother I could have used. I've low-key been wanting one of these anyways, and so... Can't wait to open this up and use it. I got some stevia because I like my matcha to be a little bit on the sweeter side. Usually when I go to like Starbucks, I will um, get like a pump or two of white mocha. That's my secret to my good matcha. I couldn't find that. And I think the only place I could probably find that would be like Amazon. This is the one I got. This is the Aya brand matcha um, organic. And it's ceremonial grade. I don't really know what that means. I heard that this is a really good one. So, and like this, a little goes a long way for matcha. So like this thing is gonna last forever. Not forever, but like a while. The last thing I got was food because I haven't eaten yet and I was hungry. And so I went to the hot bar. They had just set out everything like brand new. And wow, yum, big ass meal. I got... Um, pulled pork, mac and cheese, and then some vegetables. Very delicious. It smells so good. I'll do a taste test for the food and then for the matcha. Um, I'm not very like, I don't, I have, I just like started drinking matcha, so I don't really know much about it, but I'm trying to find good matcha. So hopefully this is a good one that I like and that I can keep buying, but this was 15 bucks. Um, matcha is expensive. The stevia is $8. The milk frother was $12.99. The food was $13. So my Amazon package, um, I got my handgun stapler so I can reupholster this sofa. I'm actually gonna go to West Elm on Thursday and look at like their curtains, like their clearance curtains to see what they have. I need something that's about like a little over 96 inches long so I can like get the whole back of the sofa in one piece. I just obviously need to do the sewing for the cushions and then for like the arms. I'm probably going to reuse the fabric that's currently on it as like a stencil so that I know like what size it needs to be. The other thing I got was um, staples for the staple gun. I swear I got two kinds of staples, but there's only one. So maybe the other one just wasn't in this package. Whatever. First, I'm gonna open the match. Wow, match powder everywhere. Mm. 
Very cool. It smells just like tea, just like matcha. Well, let's open this. So I'm gonna open, I'm gonna open this up right now. So whisk, it needs two double A batteries. I'm just gonna put in the two. There's like matcha inside my nail. Um, don't do what I just did. Um, I just turned this on in the water and then I got water everywhere. Just reading the instructions, they say um, sift two bamboo scoops or half a teaspoon of matcha into a tea bowl and then two to three ounces of hot water at roughly 180 degrees and then whisk with the matcha whisk. I'm gonna get one of those soon. And then, um, and a matcha bowl. And then just do it until it's smooth and you can add up to six ounces of hot water. Don't really know exactly how to measure out this water. I literally just got hot water from like the coffee machine in the hallway. Okay, I guess my measuring cup has ounces in it. And so I am just gonna measure it up to two and then start from there. Here's the water. Um, I'm just gonna get a teaspoon. I'm gonna try to use this thing. It's an oil filter to see if I can use it to like um, sift the matcha. But we're gonna do two scoopy or just one scoop. Just one little scoop. Okay, that's not really working. <laughs> so we're just gonna pour it in there. And then we're going to just... Oh my gosh. Everywhere. Guys, I don't know how you do this. Like, this is getting everywhere. So that looks about good. There's matcha. There's literally matcha all over me. Okay. Now I'm gonna pour this milk in here. And shake the stevia. We're gonna do just It's like a drop. Like, did I just do a drop? I don't know. Okay, bad idea. Let's not do that again. Too much milk. Okay. Oh my gosh. That was so chaotic. Here's the first taste of the match. I literally was just drinking froth. Very delicious. Perf. Now that we got our match, I'm going to try the... I'm gonna try the pork first. It looks a little dry, not gonna lie. It's definitely dry. Uh, it's really good though. 
I like this seasoning. It has a really good amount of seasoning and saltiness and just flavor to it. And then we're gonna try the mac and cheese. Yeah, very simple, basic, just baked mac and cheese. I'm gonna try with the pork. Mm -hmm. Yep. We're gonna try all the vegetables, which is bell pepper and um, yellow and green zucchinis or like squash, I don't know. Mmm. Mmm. Delish, delish. I would get again, yeah. I'm gonna finish eating and then watch probably some YouTube and I'll see you guys in a bit. We're in my bathroom and I'm gonna clean my entire house today. I'm gonna scrub everything and I'm gonna start in the bathroom. First, I'm gonna go with this barkeeper's friend and see if this works to get like the weird like water stains out. scrub the toilet and I'm about to do all this counter space here. the whole floor and vacuumed. It smells super clean. I did one side of my hand. The other hand I ripped off um, because my thumb fell off. And so this is this hand. Um, they're just press-ons. And then I also got, um, we're at Fusion Pokey right now. And I got a rice, a Thai chili rice bowl and um, peach flavor tea. Oh, 
Good morning. It is the next day again, and I didn't record anything after we got food last night. The food was delicious. This is the end of the vlog. Thanks for watching, and I hope you guys enjoyed um, just doing a bunch of random stuff with me. Um, I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye.